All right, so kindergarten, today what we are going to do is we're going to continue with our heart theme, and we are going to be following Chris Uphugh's style of art. So we're going to continue with the hearts, but today we're not going to use emoji faces like we did last class. So today what you're going to do is you are instead going to use bright colors, but we're going to create concentric hearts. If you remember, concentric means that it repeats over and over again, but does not touch the shape before it. So let me show you what I mean. So you're going to draw a heart just like Chris Uphughes would do in his heart art. We've had lots of practice drawing our shapes. And then what you're going to do is you're going to draw another heart around that, making sure that it doesn't touch and you have space in between. All right, so then we're going to draw another heart around that. And we're just going to keep going until we can't draw hearts anymore. Now, when I start to run out of room at the top of my paper, what I'm going to do that is I can start adding rainbows to the outside like Chris Uphughes would do in his murals. And maybe this one I want to go down. Now we drew these lines in pencil, but we're going to trace them using oil pastels. So these are my oil pastels. And you can pick whatever colors you want to use. I'm going to use rainbow colors. So I'm going to try to use as many colors as I can. And what we're doing is we're pretending that this oil pastel is the car, remember? And the pencil line is my road. And it's icy out. So we want to take our time and drive slowly on our pencil line so that our car doesn't go off the road. Now I'm going to change colors. I'm going to switch to green. And like I said, it's up to you what colors you use if you want to create a pattern. But you're going to be using the oil pastels found in your table drawer. And if you remember number threes, that's your job to go grab that drawer and that's where you'll find your oil pastels. You'll also find your pencils for drawing your hearts in that drawer. Now, we don't need to color in between because we're going to use paint the next time I see you and fill in between those lines. Now we're going to keep tracing all those lines until we have all our pencil lines covered with oil pastels. At the end of art class, <coughs> you can take these papers and put them in your table drawer and save them for the next time I see you. Have fun creating your hearts, your concentric